The raids on Lochaba and Shiremore were a series of military operations conducted by the British Hanoverian government in the Scottish Highlands between May and August of 1746. These raids were part of the efforts to bring an end to the Jacobite Rising of 1745 and are often referred to as the mopping up operations. The background of these raids can be traced back to the Jacobite Rising of 1745, which ultimately ended with the defeat of the Jacobite forces at the Battle of Culloden on April 16, 1746. Following this defeat, the British Hanoverian government, under the command of Lord Loudoun, ordered the independent companies of militia to march to Fort Augustus. These independent companies were made up of various Highland clans such as the Macdonalds, Mackenzies, Rosses, Grants, and Mackays. The raids on Lochaba and Shiremore began on May 22, 1746, with Lord Loudoun leading 300 regular troops and 250 men of the Campbell of Argyle militia, along with the eight independent Highland companies, down the Great Glen. Meanwhile, George Munro of Culcairn led another 300 regulars and eight independent Highland companies through Glengarry to meet up with Lord Loudoun's force at Loch Arcade. On May 24, Lord Loudoun's forces almost captured the rebel Jacobite, Donald Cameron of Lochiel, who was forced to disperse his men and flee to Rannoch. The following day, Lord Loudoun left Achnacarry after large numbers of Camerons had come in and surrendered their arms. Loudon then marched to Moy, while the regular troops were ordered back to Fort Augustus. The raids on Shiremore began on June 1, 1746, with the arrival of the two Sutherland Independent Companies and one of the Macleod Independent Companies. By June 3, the remaining Macleod Companies and the three Macdonald Companies had also arrived, and the two Mackay Companies had also joined the operation. These companies made returns of their soldiers and worked to root out the remaining rebels who were still in arms. As the raids on Lochaba and Shiremore continued, many rebels surrendered themselves and their arms, while others were captured and punished. The raids also included the hunt for the Jacobite leader, Bonnie Prince Charles Edward Stuart, otherwise known as the Young Pretender.